Hello Internet, welcome to The Collective Arcana, a channel all about tabletop gaming. I have not forgotten about The Mighty Nine. I think I'm a little um, hesitant to finish these up because I'm running out and I'm having such a good time with them that kind of bums me out that I'm almost through them all. I mean, I have plenty of minis to paint, but it's, you know, these are so cool. And Bow is so much fun because how often do you get to use these like seafoam greens and these bright blues? I just love the colors in her outfit. The number one most important tip for bow is to practice your wet blending. That's when you blend the two colors together with a wet brush, obviously, with extra water. Kind of like building up ink washes. I will say I've noticed that craft store paint wet blends a lot better than the expensive paints. So there is a mixture on this many of several different brands of paint, but for the bright colors, I kind of leaned into the craft store paints. The other big tip I have for this one... It can be kind of tricky to paint like a shaved head or a beard. And I've found that it helps to do a wash with gray in it to give that stubble look. And I thought this went really well with her hair on the shaved parts. I did have some trouble getting the detail to show in her shirt. So I had to do kind of a dramatic controlled dry brush to make those like textures show. And also before I did that, you couldn't really see that sort of wrap effect. So you might have to go in and kind of draw those lines and, and make them exist, even if your mini doesn't have them. I know some of the minis have better quality than others. And the same thing with her muscles. Go in there and, and make sure those lines are showing. Give her some abs, you know, and then highlight the high parts to really make them pop out. I think painting abs on minis is so much fun. <laughs> So it's so rewarding. I'm going to keep these quick. They're more like tips videos and not tutorials. So I am going to go ahead and get the Caleb video up too because I did finish painting him. A lot of fun. And the next one I'll be working on is Yasha, which I'm really excited about. And I, I am going to try to get through these because we have the big Reaper Kickstarter coming in this month or next month. And so my unpainted queue is about to probably triple. <laughs> so I better get to it. I know a lot of you are using these videos as kind of like color guides, so I hope this helps. I'm going to put some still pictures up on the blog so that you can use them for reference if you need them. Stay tuned for the uh, Caleb video, which I'll probably be posting at the same time as this one. So thanks for watching.